my fellow Americans, President of the United States is the toughest job in the world. And I come here before you as a man who knows Hillary Clinton well. I have worked alongside her, and I have competed against her. And I'm here to tell you that Hillary Clinton is as tough as they come. She will stand up to ISIS. She will stand up to the Russians, and with Tim Kaine at her side, she will never stop fighting for our children and our families, because Hillary Clinton knows when our families are strong, America is strong. Now, Donald Trump, he's a different story. He will not fight for us. He feeds off of economic fears and failures, stirs up false divisions and ancient hates, turns anger into a political weapon. But my friends, anger never fed a hungry child, did it? Anger never protected a family's home or sent a kid to college. Anger never built a great republic. I say, to hell with Trump's American nightmare. We believe in the American dream. We believe, as Hillary Clinton believes, that no American family who works hard should have to raise their children in poverty. Donald Trump, on the other hand, has actually said, quote, wages are too high. Wages are too high. Really, Donald? I'll tell you what's too high. College tuition is too high. I'll tell you what's too high. The cost of childcare, that's too high. The number of American children who live in poverty, that's too high. Donald Trump's opinion of himself, that's way too high. You see, actually, Donald, American wages, in fact, are too low. Our economy isn't money. It is people. It is all of our people. And Hillary Clinton and Tim Kaine will fight to make sure that every family who's willing to work hard can actually get ahead again in America. <laughs> On climate change, like you and me, and in fact, like our children and grandchildren, Hillary Clinton believes in science. She understands that climate change is not only a real threat, it's also the greatest job creation opportunity to come to the United States in a hundred years. Now, Donald Trump, on the other hand, does not believe in science. He says, and again I quote, the concept of global warming was created by and for the Chinese. I'll tell you what, if the Chinese were really capable of designing some kind of diabolical farce to hurt America, they wouldn't invent global warming, they'd invent Donald Trump. This much we know for sure. Donald Trump has been a bully his whole life. But here's what I learned in elementary school on the playgrounds. Bullies are really just cowards in disguise. The America we love does not engage in torture. The America we love does not build walls and shameful for-profit prisons. The America we love does not lock up women and children in disgraceful immigrant detention camps. Unlike 
that immigrant bashing carnival barker Donald Trump, Hillary Clinton understands the enduring symbol of the United States of America is not the barbed wire fence, it is the Statue of Liberty. And so, my fellow Democrats, anger and fear had their moment last week, but now it is our time. Time to stand up for each other, stand up for our shared promise, stand up for the goodness and the hope in every American heart. It's time to put a bully racist in his place and a tough woman in hers. The White House, Hillary Clinton, Tim Kaine, forward together, stronger together. The country we carry in our hearts is waiting.